So find a comfortable seat of practice. And for me, especially when I'm wanting to stay alert and attentive, I like to take a seated posture. If you'd prefer to really deepen into comfort and relaxation, absolutely choose to lay down. In whichever posture you've chosen, feel yourself grounded or rooted down. So feel a heaviness in your hips. And be really generous with your weight. So sink into the heaviness of your hips. And you can almost even imagine that you have roots or a tail growing down from your hips into the earth. You can feel them and sense them spreading out in all directions. Or if you've got a tail, perhaps it's really rooting down all the way into the center of the earth and perhaps even wrapping around that crystalline core. And so from that really beautifully rooted base, lengthen up through the spine. So again, this is either if you're seated or laying down. Roll the shoulders back and down and under. And feel how that opens up the chest. You can tuck the chin slightly and lengthen through the top of the head. And feel an equal weightedness on both sides of the body. And you might notice that there is a rock or a sway in your body. Gentle movement, particularly with the breath in and out. Movement is welcome. You can close the eyes or soften the gaze. And become present to this moment. So often we engage with time and space in a very hurried way seeking to get through it onto the next one. And on this day of summer solstice, in reflection of this longest day of the year, I invite you to pause, to become present to, starting to watch your breath. So noticing the breath as it flows in and as it flows out. So notice where you feel the breath as you breathe in. Do you feel it up in your throat, your chest, or maybe even down into your belly? Is it deep or is it shallow? Is there constriction or tightness? Or does it feel flowing and easeful? And as you breathe out, as you release the breath, again, where do you feel it? Is it mostly up in your chest and your throat? Or do you feel it all the way down into your belly? And you really take the time here to slow down and to get curious because again, in this time of summer solstice, we're shifting from action to nourishment. So up until this point, there's been a lot of hurriedness a lot of pushing, a lot of striving, a lot of goal setting. And I invite you to really take this moment to pause, to sink into the moment, to surrender to it. Starting to deepen the breath, so breathing in through the nose, breathing down into the belly. So as you breathe in slowly, 
expand into the belly. Exhale, release gently out the mouth. Bringing a little bit more softness into the body. In through the nose, all the way down into the belly. Exhale and release. One more. And as you breathe out, really feel a softening flow throughout your body, almost like warm liquid honey softening all of the edges, all of the spaces of holding and tension, bringing warmth and ease into the body. Noticing any expression of personality releasing off of the face, all of the facial muscles relax. The shoulders drop down, soften. The chest becomes heavy and soft and warm. Feel that moving all the way down into the belly, the hips, the legs, the feet, the arms, the hands. And in this space of opening and softness, I invite you to bring up a picture in your mind's eye. A picture of somewhere that you feel connected to. It could be a place in nature where you are really deeply connected to that space somewhere that you feel alive and supported, held. So bring up a place that feels really true to you. Perhaps you've worked with this space before, or perhaps it's brand new to you. And the space is going to contain the energy of this solstice day, this shift from action to nourishment. Weaving the garden of your mind, your body, your soul, and recommitting to what is true, what is aligned in the highest vision seeking to express through you. And so in this space, I invite you to explore the edges. Perhaps you walk around the edges of the space. Or perhaps if you're not limited in your dream vision by the speed of walking or your human form, perhaps you fly. Perhaps you glide. Maybe you move even faster than that. Release all constriction or rules in this space. And allow yourself to drop into the dream. Into this space of possibility. And again, exploring the edges, the boundaries. And these boundaries aren't designed to keep out. Rather, they are designed to really contain something special. And after you've completed this exploration of the edges, Turn your attention to what is contained within the space. Perhaps there are 
trees or plants or a body of water or rocks or perhaps even animals. Allow yourself to be guided, to be drawn forward, to meet an object, a plant, an animal, whatever it is that is calling your attention. In the space of exploration, in the space of the dream, we trust those signs, we trust those small pulls, those glimmers, those whispers. And so I invite you to face, to gaze upon whatever it is that you've been drawn to. And get so curious about why you are drawn to this object, this plant, or this animal, whatever it is that you've been drawn to. Now I'd like you to offer to this guide, offer to this dream guide, what it is that is resting in your heart in this moment. Again, at this peak of seasonal shift, of moving from action to nourishment, what is your heart calling for? What are you longing for? In this remainder of the year. Speak those words of desire, of request. This is what I'm dreaming of. This is what I'm creating. <clears throat> And witness as you share these words with your dream guide that it is received. And so continue until you feel complete. your heart feels as though it's been received. Again, in this dream space of absolute possibility and dynamism, that energy of creation, your guide invites you to now take a different perspective. You feel a welcoming, an invitation to merge with your guide, to become one with your guide. And so you feel and sense that you actually shift into that form. Again, perhaps it's a plant, a rock, an animal, whatever it is. Allow yourself to become it. Feel your form shifting, your body, even your mind and your spirit shifting. Knowing again that you've been guided here. And in this form, you see yourself gazing at your humanness, at the one who met you here in this dream space. And in this space of possibility, you remember receiving the words of their dream, of their desire. And 
And now as this new form, holding the possibility and the energy of both your humanness and of your dream guide, offer direction, offer reflection and guidance to your human self. Feel and sense the words coming out of your mouth and the messages being relayed, whether through word or sound or image or even sense. Continue to share until you feel complete. And in that space of completion, I invite you to hold the energy of gratitude. Gratitude for the invitation to become your dream guide. And as you offer your thankfulness, you feel yourself shifting back into your human form. Once again, gazing upon your guide. Feeling now the integration, both of your desire and the sacred messages of the dream understanding and knowing that this dream space is actually the home of your higher self of spirit that the messages that you receive in this space are sacred and again at this turning point from action to nourishment, sustaining. We allow ourselves to really embrace the energy of gratitude, receiving the abundance that is present here in this moment. Thank your dream guide. In whatever way feels good to you, you can even place hands on heart. And say your farewells to your dream guide. Again, knowing that you can come back here at any time. This is your space. This is available to you at any time. And you once again, look around the space, noticing the edges, noticing the boundaries that have held this space for you. saying your farewells to the space. Coming back into your physical body in this now moment and tuning in once again to your breath. Breathing in and out through your nose now. Long, slow breath. Noticing the energies that are present in your body. And see if you can tune in to an emotion or felt sense within the body. It's 
connect in with that emotion and that energetic signature that is associated with this dream journey you've just had with this new intention that is being set on this day of the solstice transition from action to nourishment new beginnings new possibilities what is it that you are welcoming in what is it that you are claiming feel that in your body and to the same degree that we welcome in we must let go so what is it that you are letting go of what is it that you are releasing and we now settle into our heart space so hands on heart or attention and awareness placed there offer thankfulness for any of the messages any of the experiences that have held you throughout this journey, throughout this experience, and also thankfulness to each of the people who have shared this experience with you and to yourself, to this inner knowing and the action steps that it took to get you here. Really embrace that energy of thankfulness, the same energy as completion knowing that as you set intention to both welcome in and release on this very potent day of the year the energy of gratitude and thankfulness is what will continue to fuel it this energy of completion says it is so let's take three deep breaths together to close the practice so inhale through the nose. Audible exhale, sigh out the mouth. <sighs> Two more. Let it go. <sighs> and pulling into the heaviness in your hips again, that groundedness, that rootedness. Pull back those roots or that tail. Coming back into the physical body. Peeling into the edges of the body. And starting to, before opening your eyes, visualize the space around you. The colors, the shapes, the forms. Even imagining and seeing yourself in space, gaze upon yourself with the eyes of love. And when you feel ready, you can open your eyes and come back into this space. Hmm. And I like to take a moment when I've opened my eyes after a journey like this to, to look around my space. And to notice how everything in my space is designed to support me. Everything. I see the blanket next to me that keeps me warm. I see the, the colors that are so vibrant and beautiful and, and bring me joy. Every single thing in my space is designed to support. Thank you so much for being in this practice with me today.